Hi, this is Amanda, and we're doing the Amazing Advantage Tutorials. Well, this time we're going to work on palms and elbows. So I'm going to show you uh, three or four different places you can hit somebody if they ever try to swing at you or grab you. First, when they swing, you're going to block, you're going to hit, and if that doesn't work, you're going to hit up the nose or you're going to hit up the chin. And whenever someone does that, they automatically go back. It's just human nature that they do that. So, okay, then what are you going to do next? After okay, that, what what he goes like this. Then you're what's gonna the best drop thing down to do? one knee. You're gonna palm because he's already vulnerable. He's not gonna be able to. A lot of people think that if you're like this and you see someone coming at you, you're gonna move back like that. But he's up like this, and it's pretty much impossible to know what they're gonna do next. And if attacker is gonna attack you, they're not thinking about defending themselves because they're like, oh, this person's hopeless. They're not gonna do anything back to me, so they don't think about defending themselves. So after you do this, you drop down to one knee, and you're going to palm, and after that, they're already going to be hurt, but you're going to grab, twist, and pull as hard as you can. And that makes it to where they would never touch you again. So now, what would you do at that point if, let's say, that he did come back like this? If he did come back, mm -hmm. I would get up like as fast this? as I could and then kick him. Okay. Because okay. either way, it's going to affect them. Okay, so the idea here is to know three or four different options. Yeah. So and you need and, and you need to learn to do those fast. Hit it here, go there, because you want to most of them I think are not going to be expecting you to fight back. If I were going to be an attacker, I would probably pick someone that I felt that I could control. And honestly if I saw Amanda I would feel that I potentially could, but she's pretty good at this. And she's not afraid to take the, the initiative to hit. And when she just hit me in the shoulder, I'm 210 pounds and I'm fairly strong, but it still hits me. If she really put her nose right in, or her hand right into your nose and your chin, and she does it like I know that she can strike, it is going to hurt. And then by that time, if I'm doing this, if she dropped real quick, it would be pretty tough for me to react to all those moves.